Are you ready to answer some questions? Yes. I've been meaning to know. Okay, what would be your perfect day? Plan it out from waking up to bedtime. All right. Somewhere in there, you get Chick Fil A or something for lunch, but that's about all I can think of. What is your biggest fear? Um, probably claustrophobia. That's a big one of mine too. Megalophobia, fear of big things. Well, that's interesting. Sorry, I'm scrolling through here right now. I just want to find a lot of random questions. Sorry. Um, where do you want to travel to the most? Um, probably the beach or like Japan. Japan. For some reason, I had a idea that you would say some similar to that. Mm-hmm. Chick Fil A. No. Um. If I well, I don't have really any. I mean, Texas is the place I'd like to go. For some reason, but like if, if you mean out of the country, uh, the That's only place I can think of that I care to go, maybe somewhere in the United Kingdom, maybe Australia, somewhere like that. Sounds fun. Hum. If you could eat one thing for the rest of your whole life, what would it be? Well, I mean, I've mentioned Chick fil A three times now, so I do think you've kind of got the message. Okay, how about a specific article of like food? From Chick Fil A. Uh, okay, look. So I'm just gonna state the. Why is there so much about Chick Fil A? Here, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna state the meat, like my the meal that I would get from Chick Fil A that I eat. Yeah, right, right. And that is a chicken sandwich with no pickles, a large French fry, and a large Coca Cola with ten packets of mayonnaise on the side. No pickles. No pickles. I don't like pickles. I like the way they smell. I don't like the way they taste. All right. Bye. Probably cheeseburgers. Cheeseburgers? Mm-hmm. Okay. For some reason, I thought you were going to say mac and cheese. Say, you say, what is mac and cheese, man? Do, 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 do. Okay, this is a question I think I know. Dogs or cats? Cats. Or which one do you prefer? Dogs are way better. Dogs? Okay. Would you, or do you... Do you preferably believe in aliens? In some ways, but not, like, much. Like, I believe that there's, like, other kinds of life, but like, not, like, the way people think they are. Okay. Mm, not the ones with, like, the big bald heads, but I believe in could. There's a good chance of extraterrestrial life, yeah. Yep. <laughs> this is interesting. If you were president, what's the first thing you would work on to change in this country? Or just anything you can do in general? What would you do? The first thing? Probably, you know, budgeting. Like the military school and stuff, but like we need to invest more in like our own country. Alright. I don't know, I'd try to settle the country, get peace, I guess. That makes sense. Good luck with that, though. Yeah, that's not going to be as easy as it sounds. Um... Go with a couple more. What is the worst you've been physically hurt ever? Um, I stubbed my toe one day. Um, I don't know. Maybe that, uh, I've hit my head a lot. That's probably the way I am the way I am. Um, I have a big scar on my eyebrow from when I smashed my head open on the corner of a table. Uh, ran into a tailgate of a truck. Uh, I didn't know about some of this stuff. I jumped out of the 14th story of a building and shattered I don't think that my happened. body and punctured both lungs. But okay. no, okay. No, that's, that's not for there. Uh, the, the last part's uh, not true. But uh, yeah, I guess the first part's the worst thing. Like, I've, never, I've never broken any like bones. I haven't really been physically hurt much, but... Um, yeah, I don't... I don't I, I've never really been like hurt to the point where like... Have you ever, have you ever broken a bone? No, actually not. Me neither. I'm trying to keep that going, but I think it'll probably happen eventually. Um, the worst pain I've probably ever 
NFL, the Wilson injury. Um, again, I really don't know. Have you ever like sprained your ankle or anything like that? Uh, I had an ear infection once that was like excruciatingly painful and gave me a fever dream. So I guess that. Mm-hmm. What foreign language would you want to master? Foreign language? Probably German because it's the one I'm doing right now. Oh, I you're working on German right now? That's neat. Mm-hmm. Well, preferably I wouldn't have want to go to any of those classes like that, but maybe like... Uh, Spanish, I mean, it seems easy, but I'd rather not do that because it's kind of generic or something I don't have really I'm pretty sure it's one of the international languages, though. Okay. Maybe like Russian. I don't know why. It just sounds kind of cool. All right. Or German. Part of my family heritage on my dad's side is kind of German. I don't know. It just seems cool. Okay. Pretty sure my grandfather is Hitler. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, let's go with just two more. What is the luckiest thing that's ever happened to you? <laughs> I got the same response from you. I have pretty bad luck. I have no idea really. Um, it's the luckiest thing. I don't. I can't, I can't remember. I just can't. Okay, this will be the final question in that case. What is your favorite holiday and why? My favorite holiday? Christmas just because of the, the mood it sets. Oh yeah, the nature of Christmas. It's like no other. It hits different. Mm-hmm. Christmas. Because it's Christmas. Christmas is the best holiday in my, in my personal life. I would have to agree. Thank you for taking the Kiger friend quiz. Uh, I guess, yeah. <laughs> that was fun. Just to let you know, I did do it with Nathan, too. So now I'm, like, comparing these two responses of my two friends. How different are we? Um, I'd say you're different when it comes to dogs and cats. 